This graduation season, one senior on Long Island stands out. He's at the top of his class and is heading off to NYU. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan reports this student is a true child prodigy. Uh, the density of Krypton is really low compared to other elements. That gives us that FG parallel is actually just FG sine theta. When I was two or three, I already had memorized the periodic table. Sabon is about to graduate top of his class from Malvern High School and head off to NYU, inspiring his admiring classmates. Saborno can teach the class and they are aware of that. He's truly a prodigy. I've been trying to uh, refine my uh, pedagogy by teaching others overseas. He's been lecturing at university since age seven, applied for college at age 11. He was still 11 and he had already written three college essays. His peers three weeks before the AP exam threw him an 11th birthday party and uh, he went on to score the highest grade in the AP BC calculus class. The same way that other kids uh, play like video games Games or a bike for fun. I do mathematics for fun to try and hone my understanding of the world. 21-year-old brother Refath relies on homework help from Suborno. He's a walking Wikipedia. When Suborno entered the Malvern district, his teachers alerted the superintendent of his brilliance. So by fourth grade, Suborno was taking high school classes in the morning and elementary electives and clubs in the afternoon. No shortcuts. No, no, absolutely no shortcuts. He, uh, you know, he has gone through the toughest classes in, in the school, and he's applied to the top universities in the country. Of course, the normal force is just equivalent to FG perpendicular. Did I lose you yet? Soporto says his parents inspire his zeal for life and learning. My real goal in life is just to help others understand math and science, and especially physics, because there are not enough resources. He likes the sound of Professor Soporto. Berno Berry on Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News. You heard him. He's refining his pedagogy. Saberno says his teachers and classmates make him feel like an average kid. He says he hopes to have daily discourse with mass geniuses at NYU. Go for it. Congratulations, son.